haunting video shows a tortured teen known as Kyle, shirtless with bruises and dirt on his back, wearing only boxer shorts and a shackle on his ankle. He runs through the front door of a health club in Tracy. That was December 2008, when Kyle escaped from seven years of torture. Kyle's four captors were sentenced to 30 years in prison. They were very sadistic monsters. For the first time in a very long time, we hear from Kyle's family and their reaction to the $4 million settlement. The tortured teen is now a young man in his 20s, making a remarkable recovery. He states, quote, I have a roof over my head. I have friends and I have family that love me. We talked to his aunt, Sydney Perry, who didn't want to appear on camera, but she had very stern words for CPS. It's really terrifically sad that CPS neglected to protect him on so many occasions. I pray to God that from here on out, they look deeply into the cases that involve other children. CPS released a statement today saying it hopes the $4 million settlement will help Kyle move on with his life and went on to acknowledge the cost of a potentially lengthy trial. Quote, the decision to settle is not an admission of liability. We want the public to know that since the time and circumstances of this case, there have been many policy and practice changes within Child Protective Services. It's a wake-up call, really, for this um, Child Protective Services. If you do your job, you have to do it right. Kyle would not talk to us on camera, but he supports the settlement. Quote, it's not just justice for me, it's for other kids all over who struggled just like me.